Okay, welcome to this uh, PHP tutorial. Um, in this video, as usual, I'm just going to briefly demonstrate what we're going to be making, um, and that is this sort of user profile type system. So you will have probably seen this on quite a lot of websites, like if you're a member of a forum, you'll have a user profile, or Facebook, I suppose. <laughs> um, not going to make anything quite that advanced, I'm just going to demonstrate the sort of core principles of it, so it's going to look quite ugly. Okay, so what we're going to be creating are these three pages. Um, user list is a list of users. So at the moment, the database contains two users, and these are these two users. And then when you click on one of these users, you get redirected to their profile page. Profile.php serves that up. Um, and it just tells you a bit of information about them, um, as you can see here. Um, so if I just go back and click on me, you see there is like different information basically using the same template. Um, I probably should have designed it a little bit nicer but just for this we're going to be leaving it using that horrible sort of um, old style. Um, so yeah that's pretty much it really. Um, there is also a edit page um, which I've just included to show you how you can edit profile information. So for example um, if you go to it you get this page and it shows your information here um, so you can't access anyone else's um, and this is sort of determined what appears on this page by uh, the user ID which is stored in a session. Um, so obviously when you sort of use this with a login system, uh, just at login you just need to store the user ID in the session. So it's fairly simple. Um, I think we did that in my login series anyway. If not then you just need to add it. It's not very difficult. Um, so that's pretty much that. Um, for this we're just, gonna be, we're just simulating a login by just setting the session all the time. So I'm not going to be doing, dealing with any sort of logging code here because I've done videos on that already. I'm quite bored of it. So basically what happens is, like, um, say I wanted to change my country from US to UK. You just do that and hit update and it tells you your profile has been updated. If you enter an invalid um, country or invalid location, you hit update, you get these errors. And we've basically done this before, so yeah. <laughs> So I'm going to update my uh, profile to set me in the UK. So now if we go back to the um, directory index and go to user list, if I click on Bob, you see his location is still US. If I click on me, then my location is now UK. So that's sort of, you can like update your profile like that. So this is sort of the absolute basics of like a social network type of site or sort of anything that has user profiles really. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching and join me in part one when we will start making these files and stuff. So yes. <laughs>